Spencer Dinwiddie and DeMar DeRozan are two players on New York's radar entering free agency with Dinwiddie. Obviously, he's coming off an ACL injury, and he's expressed confidence about his ability to bounce back from that injury because he did so in college. Now, with the Nets, if you know Dinwiddie is leaving, best case scenario for you is to do a sign and trade. The Knicks obviously would have the cap space to sign Dinwiddie outright. And it's interesting to note that there's one team, not the Knicks or the Nets, another team that has pretty much prepared an offer for Dinwiddie. He's ready to make that offer uh, once the time is right. So Dinwiddie does have one significant offer out there on the market. Just worth noting as we approach free agency here. And also on DeMar DeRozan, uh, there are some Knicks people who like DeRozan, like the idea that he can create his own shot, something that the Knicks had been missing uh, during the postseason against the Hawks. Now, uh, one team kind of monitoring the Damian Lillard and DeMar DeRozan situation is under the impression that the Knicks would go after DeRozan if indeed they trade for Lillard, which looks increasingly less likely the closer we get to Thursday's draft. It doesn't seem like Lillard is going to force his way out of Portland. So just a couple notes as we get closer to free agency. Uh, one other note, uh, a couple of people over the weekend who would be informed of the decision reiterated that they felt that New Orleans was highly unlikely to match any offers to restricted free agent Lonzo Ball.